Hi everybody, it's me Samantha and I'm back with another video. Today I am going to do uh, a part of my collection. Um, so there's some Carla Magana and then there's a few other books here. So let's get started. So the first book I have to share with you is the Spooklet Sketchbook. And I really like this book. I've colored a few pictures in here um, already. I'm doing like a other, what was it, a one color or two color? I think it's like gray and a color. Or it's all purple. A theme of just one color or two colors. <laughs> I can't speak today. But I really like this book. It's really cute. It's simple. See, I have this one, which I know I've shown before. So I have the purple and gray. Okay, yeah, it is gray and a color. So yellow and gray, purple and gray. And then, oh, I started one and didn't finish it. Huh, that's a whip. Um, this one was going to be pink and gray. I got some stickles on that. And I know I have another one, a blue in here. Yeah. And then I have my blue one, blue and gray. So... Yeah, I really like this book. I love her books. They're very edgy and gothy and, you know, my kind of style, for sure. She's got another book she's got going right now in the making, so I'm excited to see what that's going to be. Then I have Eerie Petitserie. Love this book. I only have one page colored in here, but I love this book. It's like foods and candies. Very cute book. That looks just like her. I think she was trying to make that look like her. Oh, hold on. Sorry. I want to get comfortable. My legs hurt. I sit on the ground for, on my bed because on my um, desk, this is I can't see <laughs> with my camera so or my light. But yeah, I love this book. I mean, it's got a whole bunch of sweets and treats and stuff. Like gummy worms. Milkshakes, lemons and limes and oranges, whatever you want them to be. Really cute, like, coffin looking cake. I think these are cookies, like a cookie clown. I think that's a chocolate. Devil's food cake, I guess. <laughs> and then there's the picture I colored. I love this one, like, I was so proud of it. I had so much fun coloring it. Oh, she's so pretty. Like, I'd frame her if I was okay with ripping papers out of the book, but I'm not, so it stays in the book. But yeah, this book is awesome. I had a few girls I used to go to raves, like, with, and they looked just like her. I'm telling you, there's one girl specifically who looks just like her. So yeah, that's that one. And then I got her newest book, Deco Dolls. This is an awesome book. I like it. I haven't colored anything in this yet, but it's really cute. I really like the stuff in the background. I'm going to have fun picking colors for them. I love how she does like this, you know, circles and squares and triangles and, you know, like that's super cute and interesting. It'll be a lot of fun to like pick colors to color it. But yeah, I love her books. I don't know what picture I want to color first in this, to be honest. We'll have to see. Super cool. And I have Retro Deco. My back is like super, super painful today. So sitting like this is not fun. I like her. I love her hair. I love this one. It's one of my favorites in this book. I haven't colored anything in this one either. As much as I love her books, I don't know why I don't gravitate towards her books, but I think mainly lately it's 
I don't gravitate to anything that's not color by number lately. I just, I want something quick and easy that I don't have to think of. I get like, I don't know, stressed out when I try to think of like what colors are going to go where and work. And then I end up like having a whip forever because I just don't finish it. <laughs> then I got Spooklets Volume 1. Love this book too. Might have a whip in this one. I know I have a whip in one of these books. But I like these books. This one's one of my favorites. Look how cute she is. If you want me to do a full flip on any of these books, just let me know. And I will definitely do that for you. Oh, I finished. No. Oh, that's a whip. <laughs> Look at that. I'm so close to finishing her. I was yeah, trying to do like a watermelon color theme. The Belle Pipistrel coloring book. Oh man, sorry, I'm moving around a lot. I'm so uncomfortable. My lower back is absolutely killing me. Okay, you guys can see. So I'm gonna try to just be comfortable and not pay attention to the phone. I just always want it to be centered properly, so I end up really uncomfortable. But I love this book. Absolutely love this book. I love this picture a lot. Her too, she's so cute. I love bats. I actually have a bat tattoo on my right hip. I love that one too. That one's one of my favorites. I don't know when I see her, every time I see her, she reminds me like she's like a teacher. I don't know why. She looks like a teacher to me. Maybe the glasses. <laughs> I like that one too. So yeah, that's that one. And then I have Spooky Sweets coloring book. There you go. This one's awesome too. I think this might be the one that I have a whip. I'm pretty sure this is the one I have a whip. How cute is that one? And the wedding cake. This girl, I see her and she reminds me of my friend Jen. I don't know why, she just does. <laughs> but yeah, like I said, I love anything to do with sweets, so definitely love this book there's the whip I've, this one's been a whip for a long time and now I can't find the markers and gel pens I used so I'm like eh, I gotta get back to her yeah that one and then I have fashion circus have not colored anything in this one either I wasn't too sure about this one at first before I got it, but I ended up liking a, a pretty decent amount in here. I really like this girl. I don't know why. Something about her reminds me of Harley Quinn. I don't know why. <laughs> Just does. I like this girl. She's really cute. I love her. She's what sold me for this book, her specifically. And the cat girl too, I like her a lot. She's super adorable. I like the flowers around this one. I don't think I've ever really paid attention to that one before. That. 
And then my Rococo Agogo. This one's newer as well. Sometime last year, I think. Around the end of the year, maybe. I've colored one, I think just one in this book with, um, I did a buddy color with Chelsea. And yeah. I'll eventually get to her. It's a really cool book. I don't have very much to say, honestly. I have a headache. Like, I've had a headache for the last two days. And it's been kind of hard to get rid of. And there's the picture I did. Was this the picture? Yeah, I'm pretty sure this is yeah, my whip. I mean, not my whip. The picture I did with Chelsea. I really like this picture too. So cute and simple. It'll be a quick one to do as well. Oh. Okay, maybe this was the one I did with Chelsea. <laughs> I can't remember now. I think it was the other one. I'm not sure anymore. It was one of these. <laughs> yeah, I did her really, really glittery. I like her a lot too. Oh, she's super cute too. I think this is probably, I don't know man, this might be my favorite either than the sweets ones. Um, or maybe it's just because I really like the picture I colored in this book. But, yeah, super cute tropical like got some mermaids for anybody who likes mermaids mine's coming up I love this picture I had a lot of fun with her a lot of fun I really like the like yellow glowy part I think it makes her pop so much and then I made her skin like shiny with one of my glitter glues that I got from Walmart so yeah I think she's awesome I like this picture and then the first this one I love this one I gotta pick out some books from Carla and color them but this is my last Carla book to share with you I think that's, yeah, that is everything I have from Carla. I'm pretty sure I'll end up getting her new one. The next ones are kind of random. I'm just picking, like, certain parts from my, um, certain stacks from parts of my, um, bookshelf. Um, and, yeah, these ones are, like, the same size, basically. They are the same size as her book, so that's why they're there. So I got this Magical Tiny Houses by Alexandra... Deninman, Deninman, Den. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> her. And this book is so cute. Look, I know I've showed this before in a haul, but oh, I can't wait to color this for Christmas. And I know there's a Halloween one in here that I definitely need to remember and color because it's so adorable. Look at it. It's so cute, a little pumpkin house. I just, I like the line work in this book. Oh, there's another one. Yeah, this is the one I want to color for Halloween. <laughs> it's adorable. This book is so cute. There's the Easter one. have like the front cover the front page my nameplate page I think is it a nameplate page I'm pretty sure that I started coloring yeah it is because I got my dual metallic gel pens hybrid gel pens and so I wanted to just color them and so I did these little houses not all of them are I know that that purple one is just a jelly roll but yeah like love it so yeah, that's that one, and I got two more books right now to show you, and uh, let me just move again. 
Um, these ones are funny. <laughs> this one's called Cute as F. Not gonna say it. <laughs> and it's, yeah, got a whole bunch of swear words. So, kids, please don't watch this video. I'd like to read them, but you guys can read. So, <laughs> these ones are awesome. I think it's just what's so funny. <laughs> I haven't colored in anything in this yet. But it's funny. I think my sister-in-law would absolutely love these books. <laughs> oh my goodness. This one. Oh, I don't even... <laughs> yeah, this is bad. But how could you not get this book? That's so funny. <laughs> oh my goodness. <laughs> it's just, it's funny and it's cute. So yeah, had to get these books. I got these a long time ago. And the other one's very, it's the same. Potty mouth food. <laughs> but it's food. <laughs> and the next one's a good one because a lot of people like coffee. And this one I like. I love tacos. My stepson's uh, nickname from his dad is Taco. <laughs> Not that I would show him this. <laughs> If you guys want me to do a flip on these, because I don't think I've ever seen these on YouTube, like a full flip, then let me know. I will definitely do a flip for you guys. <laughs> so yeah. That's that. Um, that's my last book to show you. Um, I will definitely be doing another video for my collection soon. Um, I'll have a haul video very soon too. So my birthday is officially tomorrow. I will be 31 August 21st. So yeah, I'll have, um, I'll definitely have some books to share with you at the end of the month. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, like, comment, and subscribe. And I will see you in the next video. Bye.